Hey, welcome back. This is M Simp Reason to Work.com. Another video. Sorry about the delay. I uh, just recently upgraded a lot of equipment. Um, lots been going on. Moved to a different city with my job and uh, just finally getting settled in. And uh, we're back. So today is kind of a slash tutorial. We're still working in Reason, of course, um, but also a sla shameless plug. Uh, for a new project that I dropped. A lot of you guys have been checking out the website. I appreciate that. <clears throat> and as you know, I have started a new venture, a sound design uh, venture with a good friend of mine, the Pork Pie Player, a.k.a. Matt Slack, um, an incredible drummer. And uh, he and I started a sound design group called MSX Sound Design. So our previous release, the Unkempt Breaks, was wildly successful. We decided to go in, do another project, um, and I'm sitting here with this one now. It's called Beats, Bars, and Anomalies. So you guys don't have it this way, um, but this is how we kind of put it together. And I uh, just want to kind of highlight some things in here and show you how you can use it creatively. So um, let's just jam through a couple of these, kind of let you know what we've done. So Similar to the first one, we kind of just gave you all the multi-tracks. Uh, we're going to give you the quality breaks that you're looking for that you can chop. Um, but we took it a step further with these. And uh, we also played on top. So we brought in Vibes, um, a vintage Fender Rhodes 73, um, bass guitar, and uh, uh, electric guitar. And then organ on one particular track. And uh, so we put it all together. So that same break, now with what we played on top... So you can already see what you can do with it. These tracks are incredible. Um, so I'm going to release the multi files to these and the beats, bars and anomalies uh, project really is just a canvas for um, producers to have a base to pull from something that you can chop up, something that you can uh, remix, feel creative, and just do what you do on these. So, for instance, like on this one, the roads. I mean, just waiting to hit your sampler and be chopped. Bass guitar. Put the vibes in there on that one. and of course you got the brakes um so i was diving into this particular one this is one of my favorites i've got uh organ on here and then we've got road space vibes no guitar on this track i didn't feel like it called for it um but the track is dope nonetheless so i'm gonna go off the top from scratch um kind of pick it apart and show you you know, what I envisioned with somebody uh, picking up the Beats, Bars, and Anomalies uh, sample pack from N MSX Sound Design and how you could possibly use it. So here's the record. <laughs> So real, real, real feel good uh, sound on this record. Um, I kind of went back and uh, was trying to catch a, capture a vibe of uh, uh, James Brown band, um, the JBs, you know, Fred Wesley and those type guys. So um, this is what we came up with. So this break to me is incredible. Um, Matt Slack, the pork pie player, he had, uh, and you'll see this on the video, but uh, he had put a tambourine on top of the hi-hat and was playing the hi-hat and the tambourine and the hi-hat were hitting together and just kind of gave it a nice little feel with the break. So here's the break by itself. Uh, uh. So super cool vibe. Um, so I want to focus on that first. I'm going to pick that apart. So what I'll do is I'm going to create a... NNXT, this is like my favorite sample joint. I'll pull this down to organize it. 
and uh, we'll initialize it here to reset the device and I'll pull up the folder so I've arranged the folder pretty pretty cool it's simplified I've got some bonus fields in here so you can preview some of these I don't want to give too much away and then you got the beat previews I think the one that we're looking for was the okay. so this is the the break plus music but the break plays for four bars prior to the music coming in um, and this is all recorded on the SSL same as the unkempt break same quality um, same goodness that you come to know and then you know true to our standards we also include the multi-tracks with each particular uh break file so here i want to pick apart that um yeah the break from the uh the aperture sample pack so i'll pull this up in an nnxt so i got my keys here Alright, so it looks like I'm, I'm gonna probably edit the sample start on this. Yeah, it looks like we can snatch a little bit of that air. And what I'll do is bring it here. So if, if you didn't see what I just did, I went to the NNXT and I right clicked on the actual file inside of the NNXT. This brings up the menu and then you can go to um, edit sample. And then I'll crop that. And so all that did is just scoot over the break here in the front so that when I hit my keys, there's not any lag in the sample playing. Um, and then even further, if you want to feel like there's still some lag there, you can use the sample start. But when I hear this, I think it'll sound dope at another octave. You know, drum and bass here. But I'm thinking more. Y'all. And for those of you that don't know, I'm from Texas. So, you know, this type of music, what we call um, screw music, slow down, pitch down music, uh, is incredibly dope down here. So, you know, this is one of my first loves. So I'm going to figure out something creative to do with this. Let's see. All right. Filter it out a little bit. I'm going to pull up one of my rack extensions again. Check out that all at the very end. Yeah, so that's super dope. All right, so I think I like that. I'm gonna use that. One thing about the unkempt breaks um, and this project as well, we kind of we left all of the breaks, all of the music at particular tempos um, for importing purposes, so that you guys wouldn't have any uh, questions about. You know, what tempo is this? How do I lock this into my sampler? I don't have to jump into Beat Detective and programs such as that. So Beats, Bars, and Anomalies, like this kit is all recorded at 100 BPM. All right, so I'm going to get out of this project and start a new one. I'm going to name this uh, Screw Beat. And I'll copy this. And the cool thing about Reason is you can leave that project open and then just run to another one. So I'm going to open up my template. And if you hadn't seen the template, you guys can peep one of my other videos where I explain my template. <clears throat> but I open up that template. I'm going to delete this Spectrum Analyzer because I did this prior to Reason 7. And their Spectrum Analyzer coming with the program, which was super dope. And then I'm going to 
take this tempo. Actually, let me paste what I have first. So when you copy that track from the other record, everything in that sampler comes with it. So it's super dope. And you see my tempo is different now, but it'll play just like it did. So before I record anything, I wanna try to find my tempo. So we'll get started that way. Yo. All right, so I'm cool with that. I'm gonna just go down and lay a couple of bars and we'll get started. So the file is read only again from my template, everything is locked, so you have to rename everything. So I'm gonna call this Beats and bars example. Save it to my reason six folder. And then we're ready to roll. And we'll drop it. Cool. Nice. So also then what I'll do is I'm gonna go back to the beats, bars, and anomalies folder and see what else I can grab. So again, I'll pull up one of my favorite samplers, the NNXT, initialize the device by resetting it. And I'm gonna go back through the folder. Um, since I got the multis, I got bass from other files and I don't wanna give you away too much right now, but I want you guys to see you know, how creative you can get with this. Um, so let's just kind of look at this. All right, those sound pretty cool. So those are vibraphones from another uh, another break that we had called the Coral Gables, um, which was pretty dope. So. So I'm just messing around right now, just trying to find something that we could do with it. So why don't we set a loop? All right. Just pitch that one down as well. Let's do it. All right, so we off in a few sections there. I can go back and touch that up later. Um, but the purpose is to show you guys how quickly I'm moving through this. I mean, I've been on here probably three minutes and I've got something that I think is worth giving a shot. And so now we can go in here and let's just find an instrument. F sharp. So then what I'll do is take a piece of that. I'll move over. Oops, sorry. 
can't let it go. And then boom, group all of that. Uh, keep in mind, this is real rough, no mix. Um, but I'm happy so far. Like, I mean, from what we started with and now what we have, like this is the extent of uh, the beats, bars, and anomalies kit. Like you can just go wherever you want and be as creative as you want. And you know, I've been working on this track live for five minutes and I got something that I think is dope and, and pretty usable. And you know, really it's all about <clears throat> how you use something, how you perceive it and how you use it. So, you know, if you guys have been following my site, that's what Reason to Work is all about. Um, but you guys need to definitely check out what MSX Sound Design Group is doing. We're gonna keep bringing you quality, quality products so that you guys can take your creativity to the next level. So I'll bring a piano in here. Maybe darken it up because I feel like that's where the track is going. Just being led by the music right now. Cool. Let's do that. out of here man so again this is m simp msx sound design reason to work this is how we get down thank you guys for your patience i appreciate all of you guys subscribing um to not only my youtube channel but also to the site and uh sorry about the long video but i just really really am excited about this project so if you haven't already go pick up the unkempt breaks uh, we brought those to you in conjunction with hiphopdrumsamples.com and then here grab the beats bars um, and anomalies pack these two are incredible and if you put them together i guarantee we'll give you a deal all right until then let's keep working make great music don't put garbage out on earth peace